Hey, what's up guys? It's Freddie Charles here. And today I want to talk to you about one of my favorite rudiments, flam rudiments, I should say, the Swiss Army Triplet. The Swiss Triplet uh, was not one of the original 26 rudiments. It got added later, I think in the 80s. Um, and it became one of the 40 rudiments, which includes those hybrid rudiments, which I believe it is, but don't quote me. Um, either way, it's an awesome technique and it's an awesome rudiment to throw into your playing, um, whether it's on a snare drum, on other drums, it's just, it's a fabulous way to move around the kit. And all it is, is a triplet where you add a flam. But the way it is designed, it's, uh, it's two right hands and a left. So if you didn't use the flam, it would be a triplet like this. And worked up to speed without the flam. Something like that. It's one of those things that playing it slow is not as effective as playing it fast. So this is it at a really comfortable speed to play. And then this is it in the context where you're really working it up. And this is a, a comfortable speed. Up to speed. And then if I put it into like a little bit of a groove or like a little solo, Low, bring it up. It's really fun to play. For me, and I can play it match, but I prefer to play a traditional grip because almost at, at high speed, it's almost like you're doing a drop bounce kind of technique to really get it. Um, but that's how you do it. I mean, take it slow, focus on that right hand just kind of coming down. Right, right, left, right, right, left, right, right, left, right, right, left, right, right, left. And then build it up. And there you have it, guys, the Swiss Army Triplet.